Hello friends, what is up you guys? I wanted to start out with an OOTD because I don't think I'll get a chance today to show you guys what I'm wearing and it is so cute and so comfortable. I will have my whole entire outfit linked in the description bar in case you guys are interested in any of these items. But I am wearing a kind of like a cream off white shirt actually sweater shirt under. It's very lightweight, this very casual style, knitted. I love the color. Oh my goodness, I think I got a little bit of bronzer on the top. I'm so upset. This is from Uniqlo. Super cute to just throw on. You can pair this with so many things. And then I want to talk about this jacket. I saw this on H&M and I was literally dying over it. It looks even better in person. It feels really expensive. It's super soft. It's nice. You also can move around in it. I feel like the structure is not too stiff. You can still have a lot of movement. You can wear this with like an outfit like today. Like today I'm dressing very casual here, but you can also wear this at night if you are maybe wearing a dress and you want to cover up. I don't remember if they have other colors to be honest with you. I love this color. It is definitely cool tone. I usually go for more warmer tone items, but overall I love it. And just to give you an idea, I'm five feet and it lands on me perfectly. So I absolutely love this coat. I am Pairing it with the scarf here and I flipped it around because I thought this side of the scarf was maybe a little bit too warm tone and kind of clash with the cool tone jacket or coat that I'm wearing. So I just flipped it around to this side and I think it looks way, way better, but such a cute scarf. And then my leggings are Lululemons and I am wearing sneakers from Nike. I usually never wear sneakers, but I wanted to try something new and this is the outfit. And my bag is their brand new Longchamp bag. It's like their mini micro version. I'll link this. I absolutely love it. It actually fits a lot of stuff. But yeah, this is the whole entire outfit. Super comfortable. I'm so excited to go. I made it to Newport Beach. The drive was so easy, you guys. There was no one on the road, <laughs> which was really nice. It was, I literally got here so fast. I am a whole hour early. I made reservations at Rusty Pelican, which is one of my favorite restaurants in Orange County. It's in Newport Beach and it's right off the water. They have the best literally food menu ever. My favorite is the a la vodka pen penne pasta. It is delicious and they have really good shrimp cocktail and they have really good food. Remy is going to be just a little bit late because there is fire. So there's a little bit of traffic. I think she should be here pretty soon. Not too late, I don't think. But I'm so excited to see her. I haven't seen Remy since July when we did our collaboration. And we used to do this thing all the time where we would go to Corner Bakery every like so often and catch up on our life and work and friends and family and we would just sit at Corner Bakery. I'm not even kidding with you. We would sit at Corner Bakery for like four hours and we would just catch up about everything and it was one of the things that I loved most about our friendship was we could go months without seeing each other but the moment that we see each other again, it just feels like good old friends and I love Remy to death and I'm so excited to celebrate her today. Her birthday was actually two weeks ago and she had her birthday party on Saturday She had like a crazy massive yacht party and it was super fun But I couldn't go because I was in Vegas seeing Adele and I was so sad because I really wanted to go to her birthday party But I told her I was like I'm gonna plan a whole lunch for you. Let's celebrate you and your birthday She's accomplished so much in the last year and I'm just so proud of her and so so happy for her I'm grateful to be celebrating her today. So I actually got a custom cake made for Remy. Sweet Traders, as you guys know, is our favorite bakery in Orange County. They make custom cakes for any occasion. We only get our birthday cakes there because one, they taste amazing. They're not too sweet. I don't know what their ingredients are or their recipe, but it is the best cake that you guys will ever have. I'll link them down below for you, but they also can make any cake possible. So I always get my birthday cakes there, but I had Sweet Traders make Remy a cake and it's covered in baby blue fondant. I believe it's called fondant. Baby blue because it's Remy Remy's favorite color and then it says happy birthday Remy and then I had them make three custom dogs because you guys know Remy has three dogs now so I had them make custom little dogs to put on the cake and I'm so excited to surprise her with it I'm actually gonna go and give it to the restaurant first so they can bring it out and surprise her when we're ready for the cake at the end of lunch and then I actually also got her a present I got her this self-care bath bomb body wash thing at South Coast when I was there a few weeks ago there's a new store I think it's called 
called Neck Nectar or something. I'll link them down below. But they make like custom, organic, all natural body lotion and soap and bath bombs and stuff. And it's great for people with sensitive skin. And I know Remy loves her self-care days. She loves her bath bombs. And she loves feeling good and smelling good. So I got her whole collection. And I can't show it to you guys because the lady at the store wrapped it up for me. But I did take a picture. And they are so cute. The bath bombs are shaped like desserts. And I think Remy's going to die when she sees it. They're like ice cream and donuts and cupcakes and cookies. And they smell amazing. I actually bought a few for myself. And you guys, it smells amazing. But it makes your skin so soft. The exfoliating scrub is my favorite. It's, it's a really good buy. I didn't get to show you guys Remy's birthday card. Isn't this so cute? Look at this illustration. The sushi looks delicious. It's probably because I'm super hungry. I haven't eaten all day. This looks so good. Oh my goodness. Ah, I hope she loves it. They should do this with Carlos's cake. Put it in a box. Yeah. Okay, ready? I'm sure they will. Yeah. Is it cute? No, super cute. Michelle was so nice enough to pick up the cake from Sweet Traders for me because I left the house and forgot half my life at home, so I had to go back. Oh right? my god! Mom, she's gonna die. Did you see the little donut? No, I didn't. I didn't focus too much on it. Oh my god, it's so cute. Here, you guys, come see. Oh, I didn't see the donut. Look! Oh, oh my, my god. god! Okay, after I hand this over to the restaurant, I really hope that a dog stays put. <laughs> Imagine they're like, sorry Kim, when we moved here, we lost the dog. I like his shirt. Thanks. <laughs> She's wearing it already. Hey, so I didn't bring any PJs. Can I wear some of your clothes? Thank you. <laughs> did you leave the NASA shirt last time? I think you did. I made did you. Did I? Okay. Good, because that's <laughs> yes. your designated pajamas now. Look, you guys. It's so cute. Oh, my babies. So, Rusty Pelican is over there. But Remy's not here yet. So, I'm going to go to Starbucks and hang out with Michelle for a little. Hello. Never thought I would see you again, baby girl. <laughs> this is such a beautiful view. Hi. Oh, my. I can't wait to watch your Reunited. vlog back and see me. <laughs> it feels so good. We're at Rusty Pelican. We're so hungry. I'm so hungry. I forgot to eat. Until We're so excited. Right now. I'm so excited. Ugh, the best garlic bread, Rem. Oh my gosh. That looks it's so, so good. good. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, are we supposed to decide on our main course? Oh. <laughs> Look at us. We're going to suck. We got shrimp cocktail. Yes. Calamari. And Kim said the best garlic bread. That is a yeah. huge ass baguette of garlic bread. Uh, <laughs> you have to try the garlic bread. It's like divine. Okay. So good. I was mixing this up with Mastro's. You know, Mastro's, like the the smoke comes the out. Yeah, with, I was like, why is, it, why is it smoking? Hello. Remy went to the bathroom, but our food came. I got the penne a la vodka. It's my favorite here at Rusty Pelican. And then Remy got a fish special. I don't know what it is, but it looks divine. And then we're sharing broccolini for some fiber. And it looks like it might rain. Look at this beautiful view. I feel like it's so hard for me to vlog whenever I hang out with Remy because we literally catch up and talk about everything and it's so hard for me to put the camera there because we sometimes we be talking about juicy things but ugh, i miss her so much i told her i was like i want to do this all the time this is honestly the best lunch ever and it's cold too the heater's on but it's really really cold outside happy birthday to you it's like the only me i'm the only one singing happy birthday brought a candle and a lighter for you <laughs> happy birthday so try one more time oh my God, you're so sweet thank you really Wait. fast Remy. One, two, three, go. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Happy birthday! Do you love it? Thank you so Thank much. You so much. I can't. Thank I you. Just told everyone I was like the birthday celebrations are. Over. No, I saw that in your vlog. You're like I'm over I'm it. Done now. Look at this. He's so cute. I'm gonna take them home. I'm gonna can I can I have a to go box actually? Oh yeah, it box? came in a box. Thank oh. Yeah. You like I don't want the cake. Okay, I just want the box. She'll, they're so cute. Oh, oh my gosh! Look my. how cute the dogs are. I was I mean, told to open my gift. I saw this like three weeks ago, and I was like, "Yep, Wait, there's a. So I think there's cute. a card in there. You can read it later, so you don't cry." <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Oh, <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't uh, bring lash glue. I mean, if you're gonna cry, that'd be a great <gasps> title. <cute> little... <laughs> I made her cry. Yeah, just kidding. Oh, your handwriting is stunning. Really? I wrote that in the car. Are you kidding me? Thank you. Yes. I propose. <laughs> she, yes, it's yes. I know every I year we you. should. I love this. We stopped our I tradition for a while and I got sad. It was COVID. I know, we got so We're busy. Bringing it back. I'm going to come visit you. I want those goddamn chicken nuggets. Oh. I want the nuggets. Please. I want to I want to go to Car Carnas and I want <gasps> What is pozole by the way? Pozole is That's what you're eating, right? Is 
fucking amazing. Yes. Yeah, that's it all you need good. to know. What is it? It's like a soup. <laughs> it's a soup. Thank you. I do want to eat all that stuff with you, though. I did not wrap it. I want the chicken wings, too. I need to plan this whole menu. Yeah, yeah. We got a whole day. I hope you love. I'm gonna love no matter what. Oh my god, did you open it backwards? <laughs> oh, no, no, you're good, you're good. <gasps> oh my god. How me. Oh my god. Do you love god. it? <gasps> I love it. I didn't even know things like this existed. Do you know what it is? Just, are they bath things? Yeah, they're bath bombs. Oh my god, wait. How perfect for cooking with Remy. Oh, you can use them, yeah. Oh my They smell divine. God. Smells so good. We got a sugar oh, scrub. I use that, it makes your skin so soft. I love it. So they, everything is like natural and organic <gasps> and it's good for sensitive skin. Oh my god, you're so yeah. sweet. Yeah. Look at this, it looks like kinetic sand. <gasps> Clementine, Clemmy. Yeah? Oh my god. I miss you too. <laughs> I miss you too. <laughs> oh, hello. Welcome. Hi. 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 Is it your first time? Yeah, it's my, oh, is this your dog? Oh, yes, that's my dog. She's is very that, nice. Is that extra? Oh, no, she's a comfort animal. Oh, okay. Come yeah, here. she's very nice. She's What's sweet. her name? My name is Clementine. Hi, Clementine. Yeah, oh my god, I need to take a picture of you guys. You guys. First time? Yeah, first time. Don't be nervous. Okay. It'll be great. You have amazing skin. Thank you. What was your name? What? Huh? Huh? What was your name? Uh, uh, uh Tracy. Oh, okay, Jennifer. <laughs> what do you use on your skin? Um, oh my God, you you have this skin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 She's gonna yeah, eat me. Yeah. Just relax, relax. Ooh, I really like your dog. Thanks. Your dog seems really nice. Yeah. <laughs> Are you okay? What's wrong, baby girl? How did you bite into that? <laughs> I just fed. With no show. expression. Some sour cubes. Dude, these are bomb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, guys. Show. <laughs> you guys should buy this. It's so bomb. Look, How did little... you bite into that with no... I'm sorry. No, turn around. Everybody must see you. <laughs> Which one? Which... Watch her eat this. What color did you eat? A blue one. Blue? I know my colors. <laughs> it's just hard to see. Do you? Mom, I didn't have a blue one. Here, try. This was the one that I originally had. I had grape, maybe? What is this? Black? No, oh, great. So the blue must be bad. <laughs> no, she's doing it again. <laughs> okay, the blue. Okay, ready? I knew you were a sociopath about the third day that I knew you. Why? How are you not wincing at all? These are bomb. I I love them. The amount of sourness. Oh, these be. I thought I like gushers, but I don't know. Oh my god, really? These might be it, but these seem like hard to find. Cubes? I think you have to go to like a gas station or like. Is this the? Yes. Is this the candy we all used to eat when we were little? The that sour is heads? Super sour. Yeah. These were my favorite. I'm sorry. They were nobody's favorite. They were mine. You sat there and sucked on that? Mm hmm No, I went to the water fountain and washed out the sour part and then would eat the center part. I love the sour part. I die, she did it, okay? Y'all, <laughs> if I die, it was That'd be her. a lot of work. What? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Hello friends! Oh my god, Michelle and I are matching today. <laughs> uh, Michelle, let me borrow a shirt because we're going to Boiling Crab and I don't have a shirt to wear because I wore like that beige outfit yesterday and so we were like, oh, you can't wear that because you're going to get it pretty dirty at Boiling Crab. If you guys don't know what Boiling Crab is, I literally live at Boiling Crab and Kicking Crab. It is a seafood boil place in Orange County. They have other locations all over, but since we're in Orange County, the one we're going to is on Brookhurst and Westminster, Mom? Yes. Yeah, Brookhurst and Westminster. Westminster. It opens at 3 and if you guys know anything about boiling crab, they have the longest line ever So make sure you guys show up early. Today's a Wednesday. Hopefully it's not too crazy I definitely would never go on a weekend I feel like we would never get in unless we were there like super early, but we are having boiling crab We both did just wake up so hopefully it really hits and it tastes amazing I haven't had boiling crab in a while I usually always eat at kicking crab, which is like my favorite place ever If you guys watch my mukbang channels then you guys know but we thought we'd go to boiling crab uh, for the first time in like I think it's been like three years since we've been here and I heard they added boiled eggs to their menu So I'm really excited. Oh my goodness gracious you guys we got lucky. <laughs> no one's there today I know. 
Boiling crab is right there. There's no line. I did just check their little timetable thing and they get really busy around six. And then if you want boiling crab to go, it's actually right next door. You have to like walk over there. We just ordered our food. We just have ketchup and our salt and pepper dipping with lemon. And then we ordered a side of rice and we're waiting for our seafood. And we both got a Dr. Pepper. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hello. We're so excited. I got three pounds of crawfish, a pound of shrimp, a pound of mussels. They have boiling crab or boiling eggs here. And then I have snow crab legs on the side. I'm so excited. Take an egg, mom. It's right there. There's one right there. Oh my gosh. And we got the whole it's shebang. Hot. It's hot. <laughs> we got the whole shebang, which is the seasoning. And then oh we got God. mild. Chi, 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 chi. Yes, where we are. You have five minutes. You have five minutes to guess. Oh my god, my best friend already gave the answer You away. didn't hear that. Rude. We are at Target, the OG Target of uh, my college days. Because they have better home decor here. I feel like I live in an area since it's like still like small and new. All the moms go to the super Target that I go to and they buy all the home decor. But no one ever goes to this Target to buy the home decor, so. Ew. Let's take a look, Mom. Wow, now they have the stool that I want, Mom. Wow. Let's take a look to see what they have. Oh, it's the same spring collection, Mom. Oh, they have like a beige version of it. You got oh, me the cute. purple hue one. Oh, I think tomorrow when I get home, you guys, I'm going to decorate the living room. Ooh. All of all of my stuff arrived except my, my couch. The only thing I'm oh, missing yeah. now is my couch. <gasps> yeah. Oh, I'm not getting a new couch. Just to make it clear, I'm not getting a new couch. I just got a new slip cover. Why are you going to be like You that? look so beautiful in this lens. <laughs> <laughs> I just got this frame. Look how cute this lamp is. But I don't have a place for it in our home. I wish you did. I know. I wish you did. I think I already saw everything for the spring collection here. Doesn't hurt to take a look though. I just got this little tray here. You can use this to put like jewelry on. But I actually use it to put my soap dispenser on in the kitchen. And it looks amazing. It's really pretty. Michelle's getting pimple patches. Best kind. Yes. This is the best lash glue ever by House of Lashes. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm gonna get these lashes because they look so wispy and so beautiful. We saw this and it's so cute, you guys. It's $20, what do you guys think? $20, $20, oh, <gasps> ooh, dividers. <gasps> ooh, for like technology or makeup. Yeah. Ooh, I can see myself perfect. using this for tech stuff. Okay, so it's divided and there's a pouch in the middle with a zipper. Mm -hmm. That's really cute. It's by Sonia Kashuk. Kashuk? They also have this one for $15 and then like a little pencil pouch thing for $9. This is really cute. Cute color. Same concept. Mm -hmm. It is so cold today, you guys. SoCal has a winter storm warning? Yes. Winter storm advisory. Anyways, funny story. We are at Target and I found this plant. You guys know I have this olive plant in all of our bathrooms in our home. Well, I haven't been able to find it because I think they discontinued it. When I was in the home decor section just now, I saw it, but there's no price tag. And I know it's by Studio McGee. There's literally no price tag anywhere. I even called Carlos to see if he can go in our bathroom to see if I accidentally left the tag because you guys know I don't take off my price tags. I don't know why. Probably because just in case I change my mind, I can return it later. The guy was like, well, do you know how much it is? And I think it's like $10. Anyways, they sold it to me for $5. What a discount. I got this for $5. This is probably the best deal I ever got at Target. But I'm going to put this in the living room when we decorate the living room, I think, tomorrow. So we'll hang out tomorrow and I can show you guys that. But I got this. And then Michelle said these were pretty. But she said she doesn't like these on her, like the band of the Ardell. Lashes are very thin compared to the bands we're used to. So this is Ardell in 425. I'm going to go home and try this on. And if it's pretty, Michelle will buy it. But I guess I'll let you guys know. It looks very wispy being pretty let I think me know it's gonna look so pretty on your eyes i hope so let but me know if you guys have tried it you have double lids i'm sorry it's gonna look pretty you're my monolid my monolids eat them your like touch the the ground. Un <laughs> your <feet touch> them. <laughs> and we also met a subscriber her name is teresa uh -huh. so michelle had met teresa at the nail salon a few weeks ago and teresa facetimed her sister because her sister also watches our videos and then michelle told me about it and we were like checking out and teresa came up and said hi and i was like i was like oh hi but she like acted like she knew so then i was like really confused and i was like dang i feel so bad like what if i had met her before and i don't remember <laughs> but then it turns out that it's because michelle remembered her and like i was kind of basically third wheeling the conversation and didn't know but we facetimed teresa's sister and and they were both so sweet and so nice. We found out today's National Margarita Day, which yes. we didn't know. Shout out to Teresa and her sister. Hopefully you took a sip of the margarita for Michelle. We are gonna go, I have some extra seafood because I ordered a lot of seafood. I'm gonna bring it to my brother's house and visit my niece and nephews. What is with the weather? Why does it look kind of scary? 
Mom, it looks scary outside. Why? Oh. We are at 85 degrees. It is a Asian bakery cafe. We're gonna stop and get my brother's stuff before we go to his house to see my niece and nephews. So you grab a tray. They have the best pastries here. You guys have to check out 85 degrees. We're also gonna get like this peach want? drink. They have so many pastries here. Look at these and they're delicious. We got a bunch for my brother and Carlos because Carlos loves this place too. These are the cakes and they're so cute. I think this is a smaller location for 85 degrees because they have a bigger one, I think, in Irvine. But the cakes are so cute. Hi! Hi! Are you excited? Yellow! 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 <laughs> oh my goodness. I got you. I got you boiling crab. And pastries. And another hole. Another hole. No, that's hole is there the same forever. Hole. Michelle and I do this thing where we like FaceTime for like freaking six hours, but I want her to see me everywhere I go in the kitchen. So I put her on this tripod thing. <laughs> if this isn't Gen Z meeting millennial, I don't know what it is. It literally is. Oh my goodness, look you guys. It is the next morning. My house is a mess, okay? I need to clean it, but first we need to make food. Okay, so our earlier was kind of bright, you guys. I just wanted to show you now that it's not as bright. I'm literally dying. Hey, this isn't a bad idea. If you guys FaceTime your like friends or family a lot, get this tripod, I'll link it down below. I use this to film my TikToks. You can use it to FaceTime your friends and family. Michelle's making ramen noodles, I think. Right, Michelle? Yeah, she's making ramen noodles. You know, I bought some chicken the other day. I might do something with that. Oh, by the way, I always put you guys on a paper towel holder just so I can easily move you guys around with me and hang out. But first, I'm going to pop on some rice here. I'm just gonna wash my, hello. I don't think you guys need to see over there. Hello. My house is a mess, don't mind it. My husband went to get a haircut, so he's at home. Just me, Michelle. I need to order my mom that rice cooker. I have a wedgie, man, I can feel it. It's like up my ass. arrested last week but some guy decided to put a bomb in the target basically like a homemade bomb or something and my whole target caught on fire and they shut it down and it was just crazy so it's like our main super target so everyone goes there even though I went to target yesterday when I was down in Orange County <laughs> but I just want to go and see everything but it's a different target, man. I know man I have a target routine Friends, I made this spicy chicken curry recipe. I was inspired by my seasoning drawer. <laughs> I literally just grabbed everything and poured, like sprinkled it on. So anyways, this is how it turned out. It looks amazing. Popped in the air fryer for 400 degrees for 20 minutes because they were quite thick. And this is Carlos's in here. Oh my gosh. I wish you guys could be here. I wish you guys could be here to smell how good it is. And it's spicy and it's got a kick and it's salty and it's nice. And I'm eating it with beans, broccoli, cucumbers, and rice. 
Look, you guys, the plate is done. I think that's a little bit too much rice, honestly. I'm not that hungry. Hopefully it works. I think the chicken is salty, so yeah, I think this will do. Anyways, a side of veggies, a big side of veggies, rice, and then chicken. <laughs> and yes, Michelle's still on the tripod. I am still here. Oh, so good, you guys. Absolutely so good. Delicious. Absolutely delicious. I'm having a. Chicken is so perfectly seasoned. I'm having a mini Dr. Pepe. And then Oma, thank you, Oma, made me homemade kimchi. She always. Does. Dude, I'm like, dude, she's so much stronger than I am. This bite is gonna be so good. I'm gonna get a little bit of the chicken. Wait, let me choose my kimchi piece. Wait, let me try it first. I want to eat Korean barbecue. No, you don't. Yes, I do, Mom. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Baby girl, it's a pigment of your imagination. Oh my god, that's so good. Okay, I chose a piece. So we're gonna get you some. And the, you and the perfect bite, dude. We're gonna get some chicken with some rice. Michelle's watching me right now, so I'm kind of nervous. It's like watching a live reel. Ooh, look at that bite. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mom. Sometimes I think you're more Korean than I am. I am more Korean. I took all the Korean out of you. All my friends have. I don't know what's wrong with all of you guys. Mmm. I wish you were here. It's so good. We just cannot get enough of each other. <laughs> wow. All my pack the good pieces for me. They're literally, this whole thing is for me. Carlos doesn't touch it. No one touches it. It's just me. Look how crazy it is outside, you guys. Oh my goodness. Hello, it's the next day. It's cold. I did not do anything the rest of yesterday. As you guys saw, I was so comfortable in my Christmas PJs. Your girl watched Scandal all day. I finished season four. I'm right now on Scandal season five. You guys, Scandal is so good. I totally remember why I used to watch it all the time, but I actually, when I watched it back in like 2013 or whatever, oh no, no, no. I don't know when I watched it. Ignore that fact. When I used to watch it, I stopped at season, I think I stopped at season three or season four. So I finally finished season four so good if you guys are up for it scandal has seven seasons olivia pope is queen i want to be here when i grow up i love her so much and it's a good show yeah definitely check it out i'm heading to my target as i mentioned yesterday my target had a little incident in january some guy brought in a little homemade bomb or something like that i don't know the the facts but it was closed for like four weeks so it finally opened this week so i'm heading to target because i need the dog food dog food for the dogs and then Carlos requested hot dogs, hot dog buns, and mayo. And then I also just wanted to go to Target because I wanted to get out of the house. However, I chose the worst day because California has a winter storm advisory. Some places in California have snow, which is very rare for those areas. It's extremely cold and it is pouring rain this whole entire weekend. So as you guys saw, California is getting a lot of rain this year. We've gotten so much rain. It's absolutely crazy. It's not like I need these or anything, but I hope you guys have this at your Target because this is such a good deal. It's $5 for two, and I believe that it's glass. Yeah, it is glass. These glass jar containers. Look at this, you guys. To organize little knickknacks for like your business in your office. I don't know. Dog food? Cat food? This is so cute. I don't have a reason for it. Hopefully, I think of one before I leave. These are really cute, too. Oh, my God. That's adorable. $5. We got some... Makeup organizers, cute. Oh my goodness, this cutting board is $3. So perfect for hosting. Hello, hello, my favorite place on earth. This is my home section. I know I went to my mom's Target the other day and they didn't have, they had a lot of, oh, oh my God. I feel like they restocked the store because it's been closed for like four weeks. Oh my goodness, so many things. Wow, okay. Let me take a look around. Let me grab my phone so no one steals it. Oh my goodness, everything's in stock. <gasps> this painting is so beautiful. All right, let me take a look around. I love this plant. I think that's really cute. I'm now in the magnolia section. I thought this plant was so cute too. I just don't really have a place for it to be honest. So tomorrow is actually Kim Sung's birthday party and I'm thinking of like getting an educational game. We already got her her big present. She wanted this like gigantic like five feet dollhouse but I thought I would get her little knickknacks as well. So I'm looking at these educational games. She's graduating from kindergarten. So I think it doesn't hurt to like read. 
<laughs> so I'm like, this is kind of cute. Kids these days are into different like brands. I literally don't know what any of this is. I do not recognize them. And I'm trying to remember which one she wanted. Last time we were at Target, she wanted an egg. And so I found an egg, but I don't know if it's egg, egg, egg Zania or whatever it's called or the LOL stuff. Oh my goodness. This right here is like Kim Sung's crack. She loves it. This like LOL, oh my gosh thing. I don't even know what it is, this whole collection. Is this like our version of Bratz or something or Barbie? Last time she wanted an egg. I think last time I got her like something like this. I don't even know what's in there. Right now she's obsessed with Gabby's dollhouse her current obsession so i'm trying to see if target has any gabby's dollhouse but there's a whole section of these lol people this is the current obsession so carlos and i got her this gabby's dollhouse for christmas but i did not know they had a whole entire big one i think my brother and sister-in-law might start killing me but honestly this is kind of cute too we already got her a huge dollhouse for her birthday so i don't think we need that one gabby's dollhouse you guys i don't know like this i don't even know what it is Ooh, ooh, the ears oh i think she might be into that okay so clearly that's why she wants a cat kim sung expressed the other day that she wants to have like a million cats okay let me figure out what i'm gonna get kim sung i have these so far i thought this was such a good buy this is called family bingo and you can play it four ways so you can use this for your kids to learn the alphabet you can use it to learn animals you can play bingo by using sight words or you can play bingo the traditional way so they can practice their numbers and i thought this was such a cute game see you can play bingo with animals or you can play bingo alphabet traditional or sight words so this is really a good way for her to like learn how to read and you can also bond as a family and learn together and then i think i'm gonna grab her gabby's place house gabby's doll house ears yeah. these talk and sing and then i don't know what this is this is gabby's doll house little cats hamster they're her hamster kitties. So I'm gonna get these too. If you guys are ever looking for cute ceramic pots to decorate around the house, check out the outdoors landscaping area. This is obviously a Target. Or go to Lowe's if you're looking for like big pots and you don't wanna pay like $200 at Pottery Barn. Go to Home Depot or Lowe's in the gardening section. But look, that's so cute. We have that at home. I grabbed what I came here for you guys. We stayed focused. The boys have been eating fresh pets. Um, they've been eating it for three or four years now. This is such a good meal by itself or you can use it as a topper but fresh pet at target is amazing now i'm in the toy section to see if there's any toys that old man made like but i feel like we have bought every single toy for the boys this is the box that i have to figure out how to wrap and i'm literally panicking right now you guys because i do not have tape oh my goodness i think i have tape but i don't know if i have tape i'm going to have to figure this out somehow i just talked to my brother and he was like honestly why don't you just take two big black trash bags and just cover both sides so i might just do that. I also got this cute bag to put Kim Sung's presents in. How cute is this bag? That bag is from Target. I think they're coming out with spring stuff right now and everything is adorable. It is time we try a new Dr. Pepper flavor. This is cherry. A lot of you guys recommended Dr. Pepper cherry to me. As you know right now, I love Dr. Pepper. I used to love Coca-Cola, but it just doesn't taste as good anymore. Dr. Pepper is so good. I've tried the regular Dr. Pepper. I've tried the, do uh, the diet Dr. Pepper. I've tried the Dr. Pepper cream. This is my first time trying cherry. So I will let you guys know if it is good. Let me open this. And then I have to figure out what I'm gonna make for dinner because it's already 7.13. And I don't wanna eat too late because tomorrow we have to drive down to Orange County. And I'm not, you guys know, I'm a nervous car rider and it takes an hour to get there. And I don't want to poop in the car, so. I got some steak at Target. This is my favorite quick steak at Target. It's pretty good, it's not the best steak, but it's pretty good. It's the Good & Gather, which is a really good brand at Target, really affordable. It's 100% all natural sirloin steak. And I thought maybe I can make this with either a side of rice and then like cucumbers, like you know the simple kind of quick meals that I always do. Or maybe I can make a little bit of pasta. I don't know yet, so I got the steak at least. But let's try this together and see if it's good. Okay. Ooh, the color is different because of the cherry. It's got a little bit more of like a burgundy maroon. Okay. Also, look at my bestie bracelet. So Kim Sung has this thing where like Michelle and I are her besties and we really are. Love that girl to death. And so last time we took her on a little girl's date a few weeks ago, she was like, let's get bracelets and be besties. And so we quickly went to Target and we, instead of bracelets, we got like hair ties for little kids, but they don't fit us because obviously Michelle and I are like triple her size. So I went on Amazon and got a whole pack 
of these like old school friendship bracelets. You guys remember these? We had these growing up and they're so cute. It was like a pack of 12 for $8. I'll link them down below for you guys if you're interested in these, but I'm going to surprise her with it tomorrow. You see how it's like not the typical, typical Dr. Pepper flavor or color? Okay, cheers. Cheers. Yum, how fun. Tastes like a cherry lollipop. Oh my gosh, wait, I like it. The really cool thing about Dr. Pepper drinks is you literally taste Dr. Pepper and the flavor that it says it is. I feel like sometimes a lot of other soda companies, you don't really taste what they're telling you that you're gonna taste. This is really good. I don't know what I like more. I think I just like the original Dr. Pepper more. Also, Dr. Pepper cream that I tried the other, like started trying what last month. Dr. Pepper cream is good, but man, I don't know what they put in there. It makes me very jittery. It, it just, I, I try not to drink that too much. After we finished that with our friends and family, I think we had them over and we were just like, yeah, just drink it all. After we finished that, I honestly was like, I haven't bought it again since because it makes me feel like, I know soda in general sometimes makes people like, feel really crazy because of the caffeine. The Dr. Pepper cream just makes me all like, like crazy, like I'm just, my mind is like that. This is really good. I'll let you guys know. To be honest with you, I actually went to Target to buy Poppy because we ran out of Poppies and I love, love Poppies. If you guys don't know what Poppies are, they're soda that the creator Poppy actually had like, she had like stomach gut issues and Poppy is just a healthy version for you guys when it comes to soda and I really like them. We ran out and that's why I went, but they didn't have any at my Target, so. I'm the only one eating pasta, so I'm gonna use the Our Place mini pot here. So cute. And then I think I'm gonna use this that I got from Home Goods. They're like these gigantic pasta. Hopefully it's not expired. Did it expire? Oh no, July 12th, 2025. Okay, we're still good. They're so, so big. Um, and then I have steak, like I said. So Carlos is eating hot dogs. He wanted hot dogs for dinner. So I'm going to boil my water and then make my dinner. This is huge. Look, you guys, whoa. I made it al dente. It's nice and cooked, but nice and chewy. This is gonna be so much fun to eat. My quick pasta is done. I just seasoned my steak with butter and like salt, pepper, and paprika. And then I had the butter in there, so then I added the pasta and then just Parmesan cheese. I hope it tastes good. It doesn't look all too alive, <laughs> but it does smell amazing. Oh, I also diced a crap ton of garlic. Hopefully it tastes good. This bowl is so cute. It's shaped like a heart. Okay. Well, bon appetitis. Mm. It tastes like garlic pasta. It's not bad. Mm. I could have boiled the pasta a little bit more, but pretty good. I had a sriracha on it. Actually, it's bomb. Now that I taste the garlic. Okay, friends. I'm gonna eat this and watch some Scandal, and then I'm debating if I'm gonna go wash my hair tonight or tomorrow, because tomorrow is my niece Kim Sung's birthday party, so I don't know, maybe tomorrow, who knows? Ah, maybe tonight, I don't know, I'm still debating. Well, hopefully you guys have time to come back and hang out with me next week, so you can come to Kim Sung's birthday party with me, and then this weekend, Carlos and I are having date night, and then we're doing a double date with our friend Gabby and Jose. We're going to this place called Ma Maggiano's, it's like a pasta place, but yeah. Anyways, I love you guys. Don't forget to leave a comment, subscribe, like, all of that good stuff. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.